Hello, everybody, and welcome back to an episode of the so far. We are jumping in again. Oh, baby, the streak is looking hot today. It's a one streak. Oh, my goodness. Um, We are going to jump in as Bethany, maybe? Um, I kind of want to do a mother run. Who haven't we done mother as? Lilith doesn't have mother. Lazarus. We've, we've done mother as a lot of the characters, to be fair. What about tainted characters? Um... Ooh, could do tinted. Uh, this is a little tricky. Ooh, we could do yeah. Let's do let's do tinted keeper. I can't remember the last time I played tinted keeper. It might not have even been that long ago. But I just I love him. He is the best fella you've ever done seen in your entire life. Now these guys are going to be a little hard to collect the coins on. Um, but we'll get there. Ooh, lovely. Hello. Would have liked to have blown up that tinted rock, but. Didn't quite get the chance. Ooh, Mad Onion, I would very much like to grab. Mad Onion is very, very good. As for the question of the day today, um... Oh god, that's, that's, a, that's a fast head. Hmm. What's something people often regret that they shouldn't? That you think people often think is bad that isn't really that bad? Or, or, or something along those lines? What, what's something that you think people, like, sort of treat themselves too harshly for? But is is just like a normal human thing. I think there's a lot of that going around. That happens a lot. Okay, good. We got enough. Uh, should probably check our shop first in case there's anything better in the shop. There is not. <laughs> not even remotely close uh, to anything better in the shop. So let's uh, just go grab this, shall we? Mad onion. Very nice. Five percent chance to deal a lot of extra damage on shots. It's pretty good. Obviously, five percent isn't crazy. Uh, but as our fire rate increases, it could get really good that, um, I'll bomb this in case this has got more bombs in it. Oh, it does have a, a giga pill in it. Oh, really? Had to be that one. Of all the ones that could have been. Okay, good. Probably should have bombed that instead. Oh, hello. Rather nice. Oh, my lord, no. I mean, the one good thing here is I can farm a bit of money, potentially, out of all the, uh... Little fellas you guys drop. Missed that, lovely. Okay, got that one though. Okay, let's get rid of one of them. Cool. And then let's 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 let you create some fellas for us and we'll farm some money. I know that money farming isn't like a guarantee, it does stop eventually. In fact we might have already hit that point. Oh no, not quite. It's got like diminishing returns, I think. Oh god. Okay, it's it's looking like we got to the point now where it's gonna be pretty impossible. This is too many turds. Too many turds, too many turds. Okay, I'm still getting pennies from them, but it's it's rare. It's rare. We got them though, and I definitely will take that. Now, I have been informed, by the way, by the developer of this mod that adds the cursed thing. The icon that's meant to show up above the trap door is actually bugged with minimap API, and they apparently do know how to fix it and are looking into it. So hopefully it should be something that is fixed relatively soon. Um, so, yeah. It's, it's not something that's going to be permanent. But anyways, we're going to go down, and we are going to try and do mother. But unfortunately, we don't currently have... Um, the key required. So we'll go to the next floor first and see if we can get one this floor. If we don't get one this floor, I think we kind of have to restart because there's literally not much else we can do, is there? Okay, this 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 is going to be a, a rough room to, to grab our pennies on. We got most of them. That's fine. That's fine. But yeah, I got all of this character. Dude, I've got like the itchiest arm in the world right now. What's going on? But yeah, hopefully we get a key. Golden penny, lovely. Getting a golden penny is just like, oh, feels amazing. Hopefully we, it can take us up to like 30 cent. I mean, that's pretty ambitious, but you never know. I still don't really know with golden pennies what the actual chances of them disappear. Is it, is it like 10% or is it higher? But we actually got up to a good amount of money there. We're definitely going to get enough to make our shop worthwhile here. It's just annoying that our first floor shop was so bad. So bad. Okay, let's check out what's going on in here first. Eh, didn't really think about having this curse, to be honest. There's a lot of items in there, but 
unfortunately, not a lot of value. Uh, because we just don't know what we're buying. I mean, I'm going to probably just buy a few shop items and hope for the best. There's a decent chance we get something good. I'm just going to clear out this floor first. Cool, these guys are a little annoying, but not all that bad. More annoying when they just put a penny somewhere where I can't goddamn reach it. Right, yeah, let's just buy two items off the bat and see what we end up getting. It could be, it could be trash, it could be garbage, but... We'll see. Brittle Burns is pretty good. Um, it's Well, I said pretty good. It's a decent fire rate increase. It doesn't work for us the way it should. Keeper's Sack is insanely strong. Okay, so, so far, I'd say so far, so good. <laughs> pretty decent fire rate increase. It's going to help us deal more damage and um, help, what's it called, be more effective. Um, I forget the name of it now. Drops two glass dice. That's pretty good. Uh, it's going to help Mad Onion be even more um, even more effective, so don't mind that at all. And we got quite a good bit of money going here, so we can make the shop work again. I'm not even bothered by item room right now. It's like, what's the point? What's a 30 cent again here? Pill, I'm not that interested in right now. I just don't want to tear us down. And we're going to just buy two of the random items because they're going to give us good stats. And we'll see what they end up being. Hopefully something glorious. Black Candle's pretty glorious. And I bought HP, not realising that, of course, Black Candle removed the um, curse. Bit of a waste of money in the end there. But we got stats out of it, so I don't mind. Our damage is looking better now. Yeah, she definitely shouldn't have bought the HP there. That was very much my bad. Should have gone to the item room or got whatever this guy ended up dropping for us. Okay, it was also HP, so don't feel so bad about it now. Right, uh, we go down here. I see you, bucket babies. <gasps> oh, baby. Okay, that was that was pretty lucky. Right, down we go. I'm very, very happy with how this run is going thus far, which scares me because I know that it could all come crashing down so, so quick. We got two um, Glass Azerite spin downs, so we could technically spin down our trinkets, but I think I'd rather just wait to see if we get any different trinkets on this floor than trade this one because the Glass Dice thing is actually really goddamn good. Good. Again, Item Room just doesn't really speak to me on this character. I might as well just try and gain Planetarium Chance. Okay, this guy's going to hit me. Oh, no. Managed to escape. Extra little bomb there. Thank you. All good. Need a little bit more speed. Speed would be good for just getting the coins collected. Need to remember that these guys can just skate directly over the top of everything. Honestly, at this point, don't worry so much about the money gains, because, yeah, there's creep everywhere and stuff. In fact, these guys, it's 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 going to be very, very difficult to grab their money. Because of the creep they produce. Okay, into the shop once again. Um, shop price reduced by one for the current floor for each item purchased on the floor. Well, that's pretty good for us. Um, and extra damage... I'm not going to take that right now in case I get an angel deal, but I'll definitely come back to it. And I can even check my item room at that point as well, to be honest. I mean, nah, I'd rather keep the planetarium chance, actually. But yeah, damage ups aren't actually that worthwhile anymore, because I can just buy stuff. Like, I might as well take that. Why not? Honestly, anything purchased is worthwhile, I suppose, so I will buy it. What the hell? Oh, we got a Miser Heart here? Or a Golden Heart? I'm very confused by what's going on with our HP right now. Okay. We are good to go. And we do have our two bombs required. Um, we need to go and do our Mirror Room first, though. So let's go do that. But this this run, I can't believe we got Keeper Sack. That's just kind of insane. Uh, also, Secret Room is there, but we need the bombs, remember. Uh, mirror Room's back over here. As if we got two of those. <laughs> More than we could have got. Luckily, we're pretty close to the room here. We literally only have to do one combat room. Now, 
What I am going to do is I am going to go and do the boss as well because it was a very, very easy boss and we're just going to gain so much money out of all the rooms leading up to it. There is only one room I'm particularly concerned about, to be honest, so we should be mostly okay. It was this one. Okay, good. Right. This room feels a lot better with flight. A lot, lot better. But yeah, just being able to gain all this extra money just makes sense, doesn't it? Um, Nah, treasure rooms. If it was shops, then I'd be way more down to clown, but it's not. Okay, luckily he's doing his very, very easy attacks to dodge. Um, safety pin isn't very good, but it is a purchase that gives us stats, so why not? Honestly, this, this golden thing is going to be pretty good, where it gives us one reduced price for everything we purchase. It's not insane, but it's pretty good. Um... The one thing that is a little bit upsetting about it, although it's not a, a, exactly a, a wholly bad thing, is I believe keep a sack uh, stats scale based off money spent. I can't remember exactly, but I think they do, which means we're getting less stats from them. Uh, I'm going to keep a planetary chance. I'm not going to bother popping in there. We had one other thing in the shop that I wanted to buy, I think. Let me go check what that was. I do not remember. Uh, not really. Um, I could, I could take friendly ball. I might as well. It's cheap. Like I said, it's going to give us stats as well, so why not? Um, and then we've got two bombs to use. Yeah. Obviously, friendly ball isn't very good, but it, it can be useful, especially if you capture a decent champion in there. So definitely not opposed to it. Definitely not opposed to it at all. That's what we're looking for, baby. Glass spin down. I didn't manage to get that dime there, damn. Didn't manage to get any of the money there. Oops. Yeah, nothing really to grab there right now. Okay, this is another room where I'm not getting any of the money. Just, just a shame, it's just how it is. I could have a bomb for that right now. A lot of stuff on this floor that requires me having flight. There's the bomb, so I'll go and do the uh, thingy room. Good, good. Leaving that penny on the floor is a bit of safety. Good. You should be pretty quick to take out with the damage we've got now. Our damage is, is kind of ludicrous now. It's awesome. I'm liking it muchly. Cool. All good. I want to do all the rooms, as I said before, just to make sure we get the max money possible. Very annoying enemy here for us. Again, missed out on all the money there. These, these rooms have been pretty brutal for, like, just having enemies that make it very difficult to grab all the uh, potential money. Haven't friendly balled anything yet, but I'm kind of waiting for the right type of enemy to be useful. Extra speed is what we we're looking for, so I'm happy to see that. Like, a lot of these enemies just aren't very useful. Oh, dude, come on now. Aren't very useful for us. So in here, we've got... Uh, let's have a look what we've got on the thingy. So, spin down... Hmm. Spin, spinning down bottle of water is actually not a bad idea. Let's let's play the floor first. I'll, I'll grab that. I'll grab that. Um. I'll leave that for now. I, I will grab this. See what it is. Damn it! Terrible. Right. Play the rest of the floor first. See what we end up getting. 
quickly check in here. Whole bunch of nerfing. A fire rate's really good now as well, really good. Now these these enemies are very hard to get the money on. Gotta be careful with those bombs that we'll be dropping. Good old Apple of Pride. I don't really know why he dropped. He's, he's not meant to drop that, right? Good. Item room at this point. I can check out. And we get something pretty good for it too. Glad I grabbed that. Okay, boss time. And then we'll see if we want to use spin down to get the uh, knockback thing. Because it is very good. Oh shit, I was st completely stuck there. Golden Penny. Oh, tried to grab it. Wasn't quick enough. Got hot bombs from that guy. So this is why I wanted to wait on the spin down in case we got like a cool angel deal or something. Okay, so stairway is obviously going to be grabbed here. <laughs> um, And then yeah, I think I'm going to go spin down water bottle. I I'd like to smelt my trinket, but I just think the thing that I can get instead is so good. Like that Maria's tr Trophy, whatever it's called, the one that adds a bunch of knockback and damage is really good. Last spin down. Um. Yeah, I'll, I'll grab that as well, why not? Oh wait, what? I thought this was an active. Maybe not. I'm thinking of a different one. Still, we got, we got a bunch of little chunks around us, just... Useful, I guess. Okay. Can't afford that, although I would like it. Although, actually, I'm at really good speed now anyways. Oh, bugger. Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I just realized I don't have an anywhere near enough money to um, get anything from Stairway. I think I might go and bomb my donation machine to make sure that I do have enough. I know that's obviously not ideal, but... Especially on a character like this, but there you go. We've at least got enough to buy something now. And I can also come in here and uh, bomb you too. A little bit more. Cool, we at least buy one thing now, unless it's 2 30 cent items. Then we're a bit out of luck. But I'm thinking that's somewhat unlikely. Right. Now I need one more penny. Game. That was... That was fucking savage. <laughs> Worst part is there's a penny right there that I can't get. <laughs> there is a beggar in there. I can hope that he gives me what I need, but... Right, there's any fires I can destroy. Ugh. There we go. God damn it. That was annoying, but we're back now. At least we got the two speed to zoom back. Right, down we go. God damn it, Gabe. <laughs> Why gotta be like this? Well, that's pretty goddamn good. I'll be taking that, thank you. No spin down this time. Easy. Very nice. Yeah, this has given us piercing as well as all the other abilities the dogma thing comes with, which is rather nice. Don't know what that is, so I'm not going to bother. Sack rooms are kind of interesting, but scary as hell. 
move back this way. Find our actual shop and try and gain some stuff out of that. Wow. <laughs> well, we got plenty of money. Ooh, I don't know where we're getting all of these um, spiders from. I think that was from the, the things that were rotating around us. The Terra Terma item thing. Ooh, we've got a library here. I wasn't expecting that. Emperor is pretty useful to just have. Books, I'm not, like, super enthused at right now, but I'll probably buy them. Hello. Hello, big sir. I've no need for you right now, but it's good to know you're available. Good. Having the speed is so nice, being able to collect all this money. I don't know how I didn't get hit about by the fires then. Very surprised. Okay. Definitely want that. Definitely want that. Definitely want that. Good stuff. Okay. Probably not going to have enough money for um, the... What's it called? Next floor. But we'll see. I hate the way the spiders can still, like, hit that guy. Get off the coins, please. Stop sitting on top of the coins, dude. Right, we almost got enough. Um, let's quickly go back and bomb the coins up there. Cool. Gives us enough to buy an item if there's one available for us for sale. Thank you. And we move on. We're just going right. We need to make, make sure to leave a penny on the floor here for, um, for what's it called? The door at the end of the floor. Oh, I've gone to the wrong place, I think. Have I? Done something wrong here. Should have taken the reroll with me. My bad. I will buy this, though. Hmm. I mean, I guess at this point I'm going for Delirium. My bad. <laughs> Not what I meant to do, but it's what's happened. Oh god, really? This enemy in this room? the golden penny real quick. Don't be a shitty golden penny. But yeah, I was like, I thought it was the next floor for some reason. There's my planetarium, finally. Why is it always Mars? This is this is the one I want to reroll. Venus, I'll take. Always goddamn Mars. I gotta be careful right now because I've not got good HP. Cool. Good money. Keep it rolling. Get rid of you very nice and easily. This is our last shot this floor, isn't it? Annoying ass enemies. <laughs> I love the laser beam, it's so thick. What makes the laser beam so thick? I'm 
liking Venus doing its work as well. I just like having charmed enemies when you're near, near to him. It's lovely. Nice. Shop, what do you hold for us? Some good stuff. We'll take that. Kidney stones, usually pretty good. A three cent defib seems good. Monstrous lung is, is nice, but I don't think it's going to fit this run very well. Nice. Kidney stone is always a blast. Having trouble getting some of the money here. I'm killing stuff like too far away from me. It makes it really hard to get the money. Need to be more careful. Not much I can do about this. I got one of the pennies there. Damn it, didn't mean to kill him. Okay. Um, well, golden, I think, here. Still don't know why Fiend Mum starts with less HP. Need to take Dark Path here because we're going uh, to Void. We have that thing that lets us go to Void in the Dark Path. It will take two passive items away from us, but kind of just is what it is. Oh, no. Star of the Bottomless Pit would be so good right now. Give me seven cents somehow. That's not seven cent. That's not seven cent either. Excuse me, bomb. What was that about? Oh, baby! That's what I'm talking about! That was pretty awesome. Yes, that, that's very strong for us. Means that now... Oh, another spin down dice. Means that now we get all locusts from all of our flies, of which we have multiple ways of gaining flies, so... Very good stuff. Apple of pride. Good old apple of pride coming back in. Still have yet to use my active even once, but... Has it really made a tangible difference to this run? No. Right, just keep pushing forward, enjoying. Nah, this is definitely, definitely a room that I'm bombing out of. In no way I'm trying that. Kidney stone's going wild right now. I love the fact that I don't even have to hold down fire. It just carries on for me. You see, see what I mean now by the locust look? We got locusts up the wazoo. And it's beautiful. Dime there as well. I'm tempted to do hush just for the extra shot, but it's probably not worth it. Probably not worth it. Holy shit, luck penny in there. Ton of money. Again, at, th at this point, I don't really need money that bad, so I don't want to risk my life for it. At the minute, I have been kind of risking my life for it on occasion, so... Oh, dude, fire. Kidney stone sometimes. Excuse me. I didn't realize that wasn't the boss. <laughs> uh, we've already do done our angel deal and stuff now, so... We've already done Mega Satan as this guy. I I'll check in here first, I guess. This is better. I'll take this. We do have spin down. Um, neither of these are very good for us. Oh, a one-off Genesis. That'd be fun. Um, I think I'm just going to take this and see what we get. Doubles number of coins. Pretty good. Of diamonds. Black market. I'm pretty sure it's a black market you can't escape from, though. I'd like to keep my spin down, preferably, but I'm going to try this anyways. Um, yeah, I'm going to try this anyways. Yeah, it's a black market you can't escape from. 
Okay, unfortunately, not very good. Although, this would spin down into Genesis. <laughs> if we don't have the spin down with us. That's rough, game. That's rough. Don't know why I used that there. Right, whatever. Not really worth the spin down cost. I was hoping there'd be a reroll machine in there. That's why I, that's why I took the gamble. Sets damage to seven. <laughs> no. I would not like to set my damage to seven. Thank you. Golden pill on this run. It's just a big no-no. Just a big no-no. Good, good. Yeah, th this book is really not that useful considering the amount of damage it gives. I thought it'd be like damage based on our damage, but it doesn't seem to be. Give me that. Look at all the war locusts, goddamn. More luck. Finally up to positive luck. Oh, it's just so beautiful. So beautiful. Oh, it's a 99 cent already, didn't even realise. Okay, hopefully we can get to the boss while this is still active. Ah, no, we're not going to be able to based on this room. I'm hoping if we get it while Kidney Stone was still doing its thing, but not quite. Beautiful. We could go straight to Void now and not lose the two items. Or we could do Hush, but we've not really got ways of gaining money, so Hush doesn't seem like a great idea. I'm trying to think, what's the best way forward here? If I go down, what do I really gain? Not much. I'm just going to go straight to the Void now, you know. I think I'm ready. We got Revelation out of it as well. Very nice. Revelation will be decent extra damage here and there. Oh, does it? Okay, it like automatically fired there. I don't know why. I think it was, oh, it was to do with Kidney Stone, wasn't it? Kidney Stone automatically charges and fires it. Good. Out of the way. Go for as many bosses as we can beforehand, but we'll see how that ends up going. Oh, that was glitchy. Luck penny there that I missed. Oh well. Of course. The first boss. Clearly not what I was hoping for. This this puts us in a kind of a bad spot actually. I was hoping to get like a card or something to go in here with for escape slash healing. Don't have that anymore. We're doing insane damage. I mean, that's one big positive. We're really just wrecking the hell out of him. It's the it's the knockback item, whatever that is. The, it stacks damage the lower the HP is, and it can just go wild. See how far it's pushed him better. He keeps switching into his base form. That's not a good idea, dude. Okay, so now we're in trouble because I've been hit. Okay, I got I got HP there. Nice. Wasn't expecting to get HP there, but got lucky. Well, that was easy. <laughs> okay, we managed to get a completion mark. I was not expecting to get in this episode, and it was very easy. That was a very, very good run. Hope you guys thoroughly enjoyed, because I very much did. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next one.